Yeah, maybe. Like, yeah, it's possible. But I do think people will be interested in the PvP. And, like, I'm gonna start that right away, so... I guess I, I guess what I had to do in that Gascoin fight there is just wait a little bit longer for him to be closer because I couldn't get the backstab. He was just too far away. What's up, Gene? I need to refill on water after this run. I'm I'm very disappointed in that one reborn hit, dude. I Wow. Like if I'd never gotten hit by that before, then okay, fine, but not the first time. Exact same exact same situation, dude. I just, I, I got hit on one reborn already by getting shot on the first guy again. Like, for some reason, I thought that if I got a shot right before that, then it was fine to just go immediately to the girl and kill her. Um, obviously that was wrong. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that either. Like, as I was coming out of the door, there was a, a, a sh like a projectile, and I'm like, oh, I could just go for this right away. But, yeah, and then I got sniped. Or maybe, maybe I heard a different attack. Like, I honestly have no idea, but I'm just going to wait now every time. That's, yeah, that's like the second time I've gotten hit that way. Yeah, maybe, maybe it was just, I don't know. Maybe my timing was off or I was too slow or the shot came too early. I just need, like, I've gotten hit so many times on that split now. And I think I've ironed out the issues I had with the running section, but... Like, I have yet to beat the boss <laughs> on a run. I'm like 0 for 4 or something somehow. And... Yeah, I just... I don't know what's going on. Should maybe consider practicing that <laughs> again. Like, I remember, like, when I get to the actual boss, I'm not gonna die. Like... Unless I get that weird opening where you get kicks or something, but... The only time I saw that is when I, like, really scuffed the fight before that, so... Oops. I just wanna... I honestly just wanna get past that split. If I get hit somewhere ne past that, then fine. Like, I have almost no reps on it, so. I want to get that distance PB further. Is that bad day trick? But I think, I think I'm very close. Like I was saying earlier, if I get past shadows, then I think we can get the run, but. Or at least distance PB. What's up, uh, Elden Ding? Uh, Lexa, thanks for the good luck. Uh, yo, what's up, Vance? How's it going, dude?
Perfect burrito. Thanks for sharing the good word, dude. What's up, uh, Sam? Thanks, man. What is the lore of Gascoigne's, like, daughter being trapped in some building? Is she hiding? Hiding from the wild hunt. Dude, it's the COVID lockdowns in Bloodborne. Finally makes sense. Locked in their house. Oh my god. Okay, that, that should have been a backstab. To be honest. I don't know why that wasn't a backstab. Might be too much damage. Please don't be too much damage. Uh, Dis, what's up, man? Okay, finally a clean gas going fight there. Been a while. <laughs> like I've, I've been beating him, but just not... Actually, I guess I missed a backstab there still. What's up, uh, Ducio? Wonder what Elden Ring PvP meta will look like. Because there's no quick step, right? Hopefully. I I mean I, I know nothing about the game. I, I've heard that there's like the uh, instead of having weapon arts, it's like I guess maybe I mean it's like they have skills that you can apply to different weapons, right? Or something. I'm, my first playthrough is going to be with, like, the biggest weapon I can find, for sure. I've always been a fan of the, like, ultra great swords in the, in the Souls games. I really like ultras, especially in DS3. They're a lot of fun to use, and they're actually pretty good. But hopefully, they do them justice, and there's the fume or something. It's quick... Oh, that kind of sucks. Is it... Well, it's probably not... Well, hopefully, it's not as broken as in DS3, if there's quick step. You're a Quick step is so stupid. This. And there's power stancing too, so I'll go fucking paired ultras, dude. 
That'd be awesome. Buff myself some paired ultras. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't think that'll be an issue, Ducio. Doesn't really sound like it will be. At least not in the same form. And, like, I don't know much about the anti-cheat that they're putting in, but... Literally anything's better than what was in the other games. I'm interested to see how that works. Like, I, I honestly don't know how it... Like, people have told me what anti-cheat it is. That means nothing to me. Like, I don't play online games enough to know. <laughs> But it'd be nice to l run into less, you know, fucking script kitties, you know? Because that's kind of what the majority of the, the like, hacking is on DS3. When you do PvP, it's just people, you know, toggling or something. It sounds like that's kind of not really going to be a thing. Which sounds great, honestly. Like, especially, I'm going to be streaming PvP, so it's going to be big. No more, like, pontiff shitter togglers, dude. <laughs> play the games online? Well, PS5 is is perfect place to play it online, to be honest. You don't have to worry about any any of that sort of stuff. At least in the in the Souls games. Uh, thanks whoever just got to level 5, by the way. I appreciate it. Yeah, Leto's is a pretty cool weapon. I actually don't like the Great Hammers that much, though. I, I just, I love the Ultra Great Swords a lot. And someone was saying that, like, apparently the R2s are improved in Elden Ring, that they do more poise damage and stuff. I don't really know what that means, but... Seems interesting, I guess. Like, when you think of DS3 charge attacks, I mean, they're not bad, right? At least on Ultra Great Swords, they're pretty good. Straight Swords, I guess they're like. I, I'm just thinking for PvE stuff. It's still very usable. It's just maybe it's not incentivized as much. Like, if you wanted to use a, a Lothric Knight Straight Sword on Cinder, you could easily two hand it and go with the fully charged R2s, and they actually fucking like hit so hard. I don't know, I'm pretty interested to see how everything's going to work in the game. And how it's going to affect PvP. Hopefully there's a lot of good weapons. Which, I think there will be. They seem to do a decent job balancing, like, most PvP stuff, I would say. I think they just have a harder time balancing... Uh... <clears throat> Bouncing PvE more than PvP. I I honestly do not like the twin weapons in, in Dark Souls 3. I'd much rather be able to power stance or just wield two that... Like two separate weapons that can work together instead of having like set paired weapons. And honestly, like Cell Sword Twin Blades, I just... When you use them as much as I have, or as much as speedrunners have, or whatever, it's just, they get so boring. What I am excited about, though, for Twin Blades is the DS2-style Twin Blades in Elden Ring. Like, who, I wonder if, that'd be, imagine if one of them's like a meta weapon. The DS2 fan service, dude. Red Iron. Red Iron Twin Blades coming back. The Lance? Well, the in DS3, the Lance is not a bad weapon. Like, Great Lance is pretty good. But it's not really good for anything else, I guess.
It's a lot more fun running Bloodborne when you're not resetting the gas coin every five seconds. Wait, so if there is quick step, does anybody know what kind of iframes it gives or anything like that? Or does anybody even have any sort of frame data on iframes and stuff? I'm sure people figure that out. How many iframes is a roll? Oh, imagine banning him, dude. Just trying to give us some primers. Some free primes, dude. <laughs> yeah, quota met. Uh, thanks whoever just got to... Wait, what? Did you guys see that right there? It just gave me the umbilical cord prompt when I was trying to use my fire paper. Yeah, Quickstep in DS3 was broken because it was mostly for PvP, but PvE was also really broken. It had 17 iframes, which, I mean, maybe you don't understand what that is. A basic roll had 13. Like a fast roll or a standard or like a, a mid-weight roll had 13 iframes. And Quickstep had 17. So... <laughs> That is an extremely significant increase. And then on top of that, for PvP, latency made it almost impossible to hit people who are quick stepping. Like, just almost borderline impossible. If the latency was high enough and someone was quick stepping, you could not hit them. So that's why quick step was broken. It's great in PvE. Like, I have to say, it's it's nuts in PvE. But, but yeah. My dad brought me down a homemade pizza and it smells really good. I'm actually starving too. Might take a break in a second. Uh, Captain, how's it going, dude? PS1 flip ring? I, I think... I actually don't know how many iframes the flip ring has, but... What's up, Wraith? Um, yeah, I, I believe Karthus Blood Ring on release of DS3 had the same amount, if I'm not mistaken. I... I know it got nerfed at some point, but I don't know if it got nerfed from 4 to 3 or from 3 to 2. I honestly cannot remember. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's not the only reason why Quick Step is so good in DS3. Arguably something that's better, which I mean, it's the best thing is iframes, but on top of that, you could cancel out of animations with it, like just straight up. Like, so you can be spamming with the dagger, and then. What's up, Marcus? Okay, it's three. Yeah, that's, that's what I thought. You could be spamming with the dagger, and then actually just cancel your attack animation with quick step. So, what that means is that. Or what that meant is that you could be so insanely aggressive with it. And just, like, you could get away with so much stuff. It's really... The dagger is really an insane weapon. Super underrated. 
You could even argue the dagger in DS3 is the best PvE weapon. You could easily argue that. Like, not for speedrunning, of course, but... Um, I mean, not if you're using skulls. Cross-country skier at the Olympics. Treated for a frozen penis. Uh, <laughs> no, I didn't hear about that. How's that even... Is it really that cold over there? I didn't think it fucking got that cold, man, over there. But... I'd love to hear more information. Oh my god, the pizza smells so good, dude. <clears throat> and I'm really hungry. Did people know about this, that little rock that you can run up there for Bloodborne? Runners? Like, is, did no, people know about that? Or, like, I found that on my own. Like, I didn't see if anyone else uses that. But it's kind of nice to avoid that other guy. Okay, yeah. Makes sense. Something like that's way too obvious to not have known about for a long time. But yeah, I mean, sure we've had some we've had some rough spots in in our runs today, but gone past gas coin all, like 80% of the time, I think, which is good. And we're making it through these sections a decent percentage of the time, so Looking not bad right now. Consistency is starting to pick up. Talking about exactly what you heard, Gene. If you if you like that uh, that combination, you guys should play Star Trek uh, Fleet Command. You know what I mean. <clears throat> okay, I actually did hit that button there by accident. That wasn't a weird input. I did hit that button. So, do most runners do plus zero Amelia, or do a lot of them upgrade before that point? Not that I'm like I'm not considering not upgrading because Amelia plus zero is pretty nice, but. Thank you, whoever just got level five. Fifty one out of eight, dude. If we could make it to eighty today, then. I'm not sure if we will, but if we could make it to 80 today, that would be, we'd be on like really good track, I think. Um, I might take a break right now and eat you guys. I'm going to take a, I'm, I'm going to take a quick break and then uh, I'll be back in like a couple minutes and uh, we'll continue this run.
All right. Thanks for waiting, you guys. Man, that was so fucking good. Holy shit. <clears throat> Oops. It's been a long time since I've had, like, bacon and pepperoni, dude. Been a really long time. Yeah, I, I, I'm a pretty fast eater. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, no, I, I always eat really fast. <laughs> like, I don't know. I just, I eat fast and I eat a lot, usually. But, um... Well, I, I, I don't usually eat a lot, but I, I have the potential to eat a fucking shit ton. But I don't, because I don't want to be... Well, I mean, I wouldn't be fat. I, I like, if I... I don't know. I, I could be, uh... Like, I have really high metabolism. I could eat so much stuff and just, I will never get fat. But I don't want to, like, be unhealthy and shit, so. Yeah, I can, I mean, I can eat really fast and I eat a lot. Remember when I was at school, I just, I used to eat just insane amounts. And it wasn't the healthiest thing, but, uh. I've always been, like, decently healthy, though. I feel, yeah, I mean, when I say I eat a lot, I don't know. Like, I feel like everybody says that. <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't know what the standard is, but I eat more than anybody I know is what my standard is. Or I, I can't eat. I don't, I don't like actively do it usually, but I can. I think, I think a lot of people are like that though. Some people just can eat so much. And it's good if you're trying to, like, bulk up, I guess, but... If you're trying to, like, cut, then it's not so good. Yeah, five guys is so good. I haven't had five guys in an extremely long time. 50. Dude, I would do an eating challenge. Dude, I would totally do that on stream. <clears throat> So you guys could witness the madness, dude. But I kind—I don't know if I want to do it right now. I'm kind of like not eating unhealthy, but. Yeah, I, I don't know. Like, I don't know if I'd want. I remember who I think Liz did like a. She ate, like, nuggets from McDonald's or something for every sub. <laughs> and she got to, like, 50 and felt sick or something. Like, dude. That'd be a lot of subs to get me sick from McDonald's nuggets, man. But I don't want to eat that. I would, I would be sick just thinking about eating it, actually. Forget about trying to be full from it. I guess that's a challenge. I never really considered that. What would be a healthy version? Maybe like, I don't know. How many fucking lettuce, heads of lettuce I can eat? <laughs> I don't know. It'd be healthier though. Yeah, I think I could easily eat like hundreds of nuggets, I think. I don't know. I've never tried. How many calories are in each nugget though? That's kind of the real question. Probably a high amount. Like, that'd be a lot of calories, dude. 
Someone search that up, actually. I'm very curious. Eighty calories each, dude. Okay, so <laughs> I honestly I was gonna guess like forty, but obviously that was way off. I guess yeah. I mean, I guess that makes sense now that I think about what it actually is. So that's a lot of calories. Like that's a fucking lot. Eating fifty nuggets, dude. You want to get fat? I guess that's how you do it. Just eat some nuggets. Oh. Fuck me, that was close. I was sprinting, so I couldn't do anything about it. Okay, let's let's say let's say it's I don't know, let's say it's 60, right? You're eating 50 nuggets. Like, that's no, that's a lot of calories. That's more calories than... People should be eating in a day. Wait, am I stupid? What, what is the number? Say I... Did someone just get to level 50 and I didn't see? It? 50 calories, 60 e calories each. That's like more calories than most people need in a day. And most people, I feel like, could eat 50 nuggets. So... I think most people could easily eat 50 nuggets. Did I not- did I not say 3,000? What did I say? I thought I said 3,000. I also am trying to fight the hardest boss in the game, so... I didn't say 3,000, that's why. But I'm pretty sure I said that. <clears throat> but yeah, that's only 50 nuggets, so... That's not good. Because most people could probably eat, like, 100 in a sitting. And then that's, like, fucking obese tier amounts but I mean obviously if you only do that once then it's not going to be too big of a deal but saturated fat probably a good amount wait what Holy fuck, I parried him. Did you got dude, I parried his ass and he died. <clears throat> Get shit on. Pure skill, zero luck. Ooh. Pure skill, zero luck again. That's why I hob roll out of the way, <clears throat> I guess. cleanest fight of all time, but 50 nuggets in one sitting. <clears throat> I'm sure you could. I, like, 50 nuggets is not a lot. Actually, maybe it is a lot. I don't know. I, I honestly, I haven't had nuggets in I, since I was fucking five, so maybe they're bigger than I remember. Obviously, I'm not saying it's a good idea to eat 50 nuggets, but... 
I think I think a lot of people could eat. If they wanted to and they were hungry, they could eat a lot of nuggets, dude. I don't know. Maybe, yeah, maybe I just eat a lot and people I know eat a lot and stuff too. I don't know. Or have the potential. I, I feel the need to say that because I really do not eat a lot at the moment. Regular packet? Well, you can get like a big one. What's up, Wayne? Yeah, 50. Yeah, you could get big ones for sure. Whoops. I don't know. I, I like if you haven't if you're hungry and you like don't eat the nuggets with anything else and you don't drink. I, I feel like m basically everybody could eat 50 nuggets, I think. I don't know. I don't know. I'm really curious now if I if I ate 50 nuggets if I would be super full. I honestly have no idea. I kind of feel like I wouldn't be. But I that is also a full day's worth of calories in 50 nuggets, so. <clears throat> so you would hope it would fill you up cuz you wouldn't be able to eat anything for the rest of the day if you wanted to stay at that number. And realistically, realistically, most people do not need that amount. Like, obviously, there's some people, if you're active, you need more and stuff, but... Maybe even I should do a, a mukbang, dude. Hardcore intermittent, yeah. I don't know, honestly, I don't know if I'm a big believer in intermittent fasting. I don't know. Some people like it, some people don't. It's not really my thing, I don't think. I'd rather just eat and just, you know, not fucking have too big of portions. Yeah, that's what I've heard. Yeah. Certainly what I've heard. Someone go follow this man. Get this man to 50, dude. Follow this woman. <laughs> God damn it, dude. I'm so stupid. I almost died. That would have sucked.
Don't follow strangers? Well, I, I, when have you met me, though? Am I not a stranger? <clears throat> Never met me in person. <laughs> Please don't shit on me. Don't turn that to me. Also, to be fair, you do have man in your name, so... I don't know. I think... Are we against a wall here? Okay, we know what to do. Get her away. Get away from the wall. Lord of the Ring. Okay, I don't know if I've ever seen that, so... <laughs> don't roast me for not having seen it. I don't want to hear it. I don't care. I know I've never seen it. destroyed let's go dude why did she die there also why is it so hard to find this thing I don't know why she she normally doesn't die there but maybe just like good stamina management or I don't know see this the consistency's coming dude and, and you know what is a, is a important thing too is that, or an important thing to realize is if I'm going for all bosses after this, I have to get the any percent consistent at some point, right? So, like, even though this is taking me a bit of extra time to get the any percent than I would have liked, it's, it's better in the long term than having to, you know, grind out all bosses for longer. So, what's up, Vine? Yeah, I haven't seen Lord of the Rings, or I, I think I actually did. When I was very young, and I do not remember anything, so. So. <clears throat> yeah, and like I said, I don't want to hear it, so. <laughs> I really don't care. I don't really watch movies. Yo, what was that guy doing? An American? Well, good thing I'm not an American. <clears throat> I don't even know what I said, though. That I don't like movies. Is that what's not American? I mean, to be fair, though, Canadians are basically the same as Americans, so... I don't blame you for thinking that. Canadians just, like, shoot each other less is basically what it is. And have, you know, a tenth of the people. In terms of culture, though, I mean... Identical. The Americans have it. Canadians will be getting it, is basically how it works.
Yeah, I think a bot got timed out. I know, it's a miracle, dude. Never before seen. Yeah, I'm in uh, Ottawa. This is right. Yeah. I mean, not entirely wrong. Like I said, the cult, like if anyone thinks that Canadians and Americans are much different, then you're wrong. Basically the same, almost indistinguishable. I mean, Canadians even have more guns. <laughs> like you might think, oh, fucking Americans have so many guns, dude. Well, we have more guns per per person, at least. Yeah, we just don't shoot each other as much, but it still happens. I mean, this obviously. God, this is fucking terrifying. I hate this boss. Like, Canadians are still, you know, maybe have lower rates of obesity, I guess, but it's fucking close. I don't know. Like, uh, it's very, it's very close. There we go. That easy. Except that was still really sketchy on the fucking girl part, but. <clears throat> it's actually not a bad idea, Marcus, because I do have a lot of lightning. Okay. Distance PB, dude. Caters to the French. <laughs> Not false. <clears throat> that was kind of scary. I don't have beef. <laughs> oh. Should have equipped a molly for this. All good though. <clears throat> I feel like I, I have to do a how many nuggets can I eat stream or something. But I, I really do not want to do that. Toronto, we we can all agree Toronto sucks. Something we can all agree on. 
I'm just gonna level up after I upgrade, I guess. Got a big, uh, big souls to pop here. In runs from Toronto, so it default sucks. Um, is there anything else to buy here? I don't think so, right? Let's buy a bunch of those. Yeah, I don't say A very much, at least not on stream. Um, if I'm talking to like my friends, like in person, I'll say it a bit more, but not really. Like it's just, it, that'd be a weird thing to say on stream. Because when you say A, it's like you're asking a question. But I, I've, I, you know, I say it sometimes. It's just not very often. I say it sometimes, eh? It's just, I don't know. It's kind of weird to say on stream. It is, it is water, but it is pretty impressive, though, you have to admit. Impressive water. But yeah, I mean, it's not. Like, I don't get that excited over it, so. What I'm hoping for is, like, I, I don't have many reps on these sections, so I'm hoping that nothing out of the ordinary happens. That guy didn't aggro, which is good. That guy really scares me, dude. Actually kind of messed up a little bit. Okay, that was kind of scuffed, but it should be okay. <clears throat> oh, I didn't mean to do R1, R1, L1, L1. Oh, I meant to do R1, L1, L1, L1.
I also didn't mean to put him back in that room. <laughs> Yeah, well, I, I'm like, I'm paying attention in case he backsteps because I, I have gotten that a few times. Let's fucking go, dude. Beautiful.
All right, GG. That was kind of a sketchy fight, dude. I like I I've only fought Nurse a few times, so I was just like I was trying to play it really safe. Nice. Oh, what's up, CBD? Yeah, like notice how on that on that run there, we like we started to get consistent. We we're getting past shadows, getting past gas going almost every time. I'm pretty like I'm pretty happy with that. It wasn't just like I got, you know, I did a few attempts of the run and I got lucky and uh just like happened to not get hit, which could easily happen. If we actually went through everything, we learned a lot of stuff. So Another run to the collection, dude. Alright, well there's there's definitely still time for uh Definitely still time for all bosses, dude. Potentially. We've got, you know, five days, including today. How could they can show the deep capitation in Bloodborne but not Sekiro? Um, I'm guessing like a 55 probably, Marcus, dude. It's, yeah. With how long my shadows is, and I guess I also just spent a long time waiting at the end here, but... Yeah, probably, probably a 55. Just got a hit right now. Well, the run's done when Nurse is dead, so it doesn't really matter. It's just like the ending. Uh, <laughs> I guess they're Canadian days, but I don't know what the difference is. I also lose a lot of time on these runs because of not being on an SSD as well. Like every cutscene takes way longer to load in and stuff. And also, yeah, I mean, it's mostly just that my route could easily be like less than 50 minutes, but because of the way I fight shadows and stuff, it's going to be a lot longer. Okay, 103. So that's pretty long. It's really long, actually. Oh, I took a break is why. I had to, I, I went to go eat is why that's so long. All right, GG though.